Hello friends, my name is Tushar and today we are going to talk about the question optimal binary, binary search tree. So the question is given certain keys and the frequency at which these keys are searched, what kind of binary search tree would you create such that the cost of searching in that binary search tree is minimum? Let me give you an example here. If I had three keys 10, 11 and 12 and they are searched at frequency 2, 1 and 2, I can have three trees here. One of them is 10. 11, 12. Remember in binary search tree, left is less than root and root is less than right. So here the total cost of searching here will be 2 plus since this is at level 2, so 1 into 2 plus this is at level 3, so 2 into 3. So the total cost is 4 plus uh, 6, so 10. If, uh, if I would arranged my tree, binary search tree in this fashion, so this is 1, this is 2, and this is 2. The total cost of searching would be 1 for root plus, since it is at level 2, so 2 into 2 plus 2 into 2, so this is 9. So this is better than the last thing. So basically, if I have a bunch of keys and the frequency at which they are searched, how would I arrange them into a binary search tree such that the cost of searching is minimum? So we'll use dynamic programming to solve this question. Here I have four cross four metrics because the total number of keys I have is four with index zero to three. So now I'm going to fill up this matrix and I'm going to have my answer right here. So let's start with L is equal to one. When I say L is equal to one, I'm just considering one key at a time. So when I say zero, zero, I mean the key at zero. So if, the only key, if, if I had just key at zero, only one key 10, the cost of searching it would be four. 1, 1, considering the key at 1, the cost of searching would be 2, because I just have one key 12. 2, 2 will be 6. 3, 3 will be 3. If I just one key 21 and the frequency 3, the cost of searching would be 3. Let's work for L is equal to 2. So basically now I'm considering two keys at a time. So the way to make it work is first you get a sum of the frequency from here to here. So that's 6 plus minimum of, if this guy was the root of my tree, which had two keys 10 and 12, the total cost of searching would be 1, 1. 6 plus cost at 1, 1, which is 2. So if 0 is root, the cost will be 2. And if 1 is the root, the cost will be 4. So the total cost will be 6 plus 2 or 6 plus 4. So we would pick 6 plus 2, which is 8. And I'll also indicate that I picked 0 as my root. So the way this works is if I had key 10 and 12 and the frequency was 4 and 2, if 10 was my root, so 10, 12, the cost will be 4 plus 2 into 2, which is 8, which is what I came here. If, if I made 12 as my root, if I made 12 as my root, the cost would be, cost would be, 2 plus 4 into 2, which is 10, which is not better than 8, which is why we picked 10 to become the root when there were only two keys 10 and 12. All right, let's see, let's move forward. 0, let's fill 1 to 2. When I had two keys, 12, 12 and 16 with frequency 2 and 6, first I'll get the sum, so 2 plus 6 is 8, plus minimum of, if 1 is the key, the cost will be 2. So t of 2 is 6 when 1 is the key. And when uh, 2 is the key, the cost will be uh, 1, 1. So that's 2. So here I pick 2. So 8 plus 2, the total cost is 10. From 1 to 2 is 10. And I'm indicating that I'm making uh, this one is uh, 2. So I'm indicating that I'm making 2 as my root. Again, 12, 16, 2, 6. If 16 was a root and 12 is here, the total cost will be 6 plus, since this is at level 2, 2 into 2, which is 10, which is what I got here. All right, let's move on. So similarly for this one, the cost will be the sum 9 plus minimum of, if 2 was a root, 
the cost will be three, uh, whatever is at three, three, so three. And if uh, three was the root, the cost will be whatever is at two, two, so six. And this is three is the root. So we pick nine plus three. So two to three is uh, nine plus uh, nine plus three, which is 12. And I'm indicating that I picked two as a root in this situation. All right, let's move L is equal to three. When L is equal to three, I'm looking at three items at a time. Three keys at a time. So here, let's first get the sum of these ones. So four plus two is six, six plus six is 12. 12 plus minimum of, if this guy was the key, if this guy was the root, the cost will be whatever it is with zero as the root, the cost will be one, two. One and two is 10 with zero root. If one was the root, the cost will be zero, zero. So four plus two, two, so six, if one was the root. If two was the root, the cost will be zero, one. So zero, one is eight. And this is two. So then I picked a minimum of these three, which is eight. So the total cost would be 12 plus eight, 20. So zero to two is 20. And I'm indicating that I'm picking two as the root between zero to two. Okay. Let's work for L is equal to three from one to three. Here, let's get the sum. So two plus eight, two plus six is eight, plus three is 11, plus minimum of, if one was a root, the total cost will be two to three. So two to three is, uh, two to three is 12. And I indicate one is a root here. If two was a root, the total cost will be one, one, which is two, plus three, three, which is three, and you get two is a root here. If three was a root, the total cost will be one, two, which is 10, and then you get three is a root here. So in this case, I pick this value because this is minimum. So five plus 11, 16 is the cost to go from one to, uh, for, for this particular keys, one to three. So that's uh, five plus 11, 16. And I'm indicating that two is my root here in this case. All right. Now let's work for L is equal to four, entire all the key space. So let's get the total first. Four plus uh, two is six, six plus six is 12, 12 plus three is 15. So 15 plus minimum of, let's do this. If zero is the root, the cost from here, one to three, building one to three is 16. And zero is the root. Cost of searching from one to three will be 16 and zero is the root. When one is a root, we'll have zero, zero as one, one side, so four, plus two, three on the other side, so two to three is 12. And my root is one. When two is my root, the cost is zero to one, zero to one is eight, plus three, three, which is three. And I'm indicating that two is my root here. And when three is my root, the cost from zero to two. Zero to two is 20. And I'm, indica I'm indicating that three is my root here. So the minimum here is 11, 16, 16, 20. So this is the minimum. So 15 plus 11, 26. And I'll indicate two is my root selected. So this is it. This is our minimum value here. And uh, the cost of the minimum value though is 26. And if someone asks you what is the actual tree, we'll start from here. So we know that the root of our tree will be two, so 16. And the cost was six. Then we find, zero, we go to zero to one. So zero to one is eight. And the, and the root here would be zero. So, that will be 10. And the cost here is uh, four. And then whatever is remaining is two, 12. The cost here is two. 
and on the right side 3 and 3 is by itself so 21 and the cost here is 3 let's calculate the cost of this tree the cost of this tree will be 6 plus 4 into 2 plus 3 into 2 plus 2 into 3 6 is at the top level so 6 these guys are at the second level so 4 into 2 3 into 2 and this is at the third level so the total here is 6 plus 8 plus 6 plus 6 14 14 plus uh, 20 and 26 so that's how we came up with the number 26 if you want the full solution for this problem go to my github link github.com mission piece interview wiki and if you want to check out similar questions go to my youtube channel youtube.com user to 2525 thanks for watching this video